Hi and welcome to the 7th MCQ video on Digital Electronics. The first question is, in ULSI, the number of gate circuits per chip is greater than 50,000, 50,000 to 99,999, greater than 1 lakh, 1 lakh to 10 lakhs. And here you go. And the answer is greater than 1 lakh. And ULSI stands for ultra large scale integration and in ulsi the number of gate circuits per chip is greater than 1 lakh or 1 million transistors a device which converts decimal number into bcd form is called a uh, or an encoder decoder code converter multiplexer and here you go and the answer is an encoder okay so from decimal to some other coded form we use an encoder and basically an encoder is a combinational circuit which has many inputs and many outputs and it is used to convert other codes to binary. A device which converts BCD into octal is called a or an encoder, decoder, code converter, demultiplexer and here you go. And the answer is a decoder. So again, a decoder is also a combinational circuit which has many inputs and many outputs. And decoder is used to convert from binary to other codes such as binary to octal, binary to hexadecimal and BCD to decimal. Multiplexer is a 1 to n device, n to 1 device, 1 to 1 device, n to n device. And here you go. And the answer is N to 1 device. So basically, a multiplexer is a combinational circuit which have many data inputs and only a one output channel. And depending on the select or control inputs, one of the data input is transferred to the output. And hence, it is known as many to one circuit or simply you can call it an N to 1 device. Here, this capital N is equal to 2 raised to small n and this small letter n will be the number of selection lines and so the based on that you can choose the input lines so always the output will have only one line a demultiplexer is a 1 to n device n to 1 device 1 to 1 device n to n device and here you go And the answer is 1 to n device. So basically a demultiplexer performs an operation just reverse to that of a multiplexer. So again demultiplexer is also a combinational circuit which has only one input and many output lines. That is it routes the one input through different channels depending on the select input. So this is the uh, simple example of that. A device which converts 2421 code into 8421 code is called a con code converter, code decoder, code encoder, coder. And here you go. And the answer is code converter. Here 2421 is a weighted self complemented code and 8421 is a weighted code. And a device which converts from one particular code to another code is called a code converter. The code used in digital systems to represent decimal digits, letters and other special characters is hexadecimal, octal, natural BCD, ASCII. And here you go. And the answer is ASCII. So, from the above, only ASCII code is the code which is used to represent numbers, letters and other special characters and the, all the other systems are represent, uh, used for representing numbers. The codes in which each successive code word differs from the preceding one in only one bit position are called BCD codes, sequential codes, self-complementing codes, cyclic codes and here you go. And the answer is cyclic codes. So in cyclic codes which are 
also called the gray codes each successive code word will differ from the preceding in only one bit position so as you can see from here the first code is 000 here it is 001 so only at the lsb position this zero is changed into one now here this middle zero is changed into one then again from this point to this point this one is changed lsb one is changed to zero and it continues so only one bit changes at a time and this is what we use in our kmap simplification and all and they are also called the gray code and gray code sequence only changes one binary bit as we go from one number to the next in the sequence okay that means adjacent cells will only vary by one bit only or one boolean variable and this is what we need to organize the outputs of logic functions so that we may view it commonality okay unit distance code is the other name of sequential code self complementing code cyclic code excess 3 code and here you go and the answer is cyclic code so already we have discussed cyclic code has only a one bit single bit change from one stage to another stage so it is also called a unit distance code 2d base 16 in bcd 8421 code is dash 0010 1101 0010 0010 1001 0011 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 0001 you can represent bcd8421 means you have to represent each bit in hexadecimal using uh, 8421 code that is 4 bits so 2 we can represent it by 0010 or you can okay 2010 and again d means d means 13 which is not here but we can represent 13 by 8 plus 4 plus 1 which is 1101 so the answer will be this one 44 base 8 in bcd 8421 code is dash 0 1 triple 0 1 double 0 double 0 1 double 0 1 double 0 double 0 double 1 0 double 1 0 0 double 1 triple 0 double 1 and here you go And the answer is 0, 1, triple 0, 1, double 0 because we are representing each digit in octal using 8421 code. So for 4 you have 0, 1, double 0 and again the same will be repeating. So the answer is A. For code to be self complementing the sum of all its weights must be dash 6, 9, 10, 12 and here you go. And the answer is 9 because weighted self complemented codes are the 2421, 3321, 5211, and 4311. And therefore, the sum of all its weights must be 9 for a self complement codes, as you can see from the codes discussed. The parity of the binary number 1101101 is dash even, not known, or same as the number of zeros and here you go and the answer here is even parity of a binary number is even parity when the number of ones present in the number is even otherwise it is odd so here we have one two three four five six six ones which is even so the given binary number has even parity 8421 code is a self complementing code weighted code non weighted code alpha numeric code and here you go and the answer is a weighted code okay 8421 is a weighted code and it will not support the self complement 
because 8421 has position weights and it follows that position weights only and the sum is not equal to 9. 2421 code is a weighted self complementing code, non weighted self complementing code, weighted non self complementing code, non weighted and non self complementing code. And here you go. And the answer is weighted self complementing code because this code has position weights and again the sum of weights is. 2 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 9 so it is basically weighted self complementing codes and weighted self complementing codes are 2421, 3321, 5211 and 4311 ASCII and EBCDIC codes are BCD codes, numeric codes, alphanumeric codes, error correcting codes and here you go And the answer is alpha numeric codes. So ASCII and EBCDIC are alpha numeric codes and they are sometimes called as the character codes due to their certain properties. And they are basically binary codes. ASCII code is a 5 bit code, 7 bit code, 8 bit code, 10 bit code, and here you go. And the answer is 7 bit code basically this ASCII stands for American Standard Code for Information Indexing and it is a 7 bit code on the English alphabet and it has 128 characters. EBCDIC code is a 5 bit code, 7 bit code, 8 bit code, 10 bit code and here you go. And the answer is 8 bit code. And this EBCDIC stands for Extended Binary Coded Decimal Interchange Code. IBM invented this code to extend the binary coded decimal which existed at that time and it is basically an 8-bit code and therefore can accommodate 256 characters. Which of the following code is known as 8421 code? Gray code, XS3 code, ASCII code, BCD code and here you go. And the answer is very simple it's the bcd code bcd code is a weighted code and it is not a self complementing code and we know the position weights are 8 4 2 1 so the answer is bcd code the xs3 code is a cyclic code weighted code self complementing code error correcting code and here you go and the answer is self complementing code we know that XS3 code is obtained by adding 3 or 0011 to the BCD code and XS3 code is a self complementing code and it is not a position weighted code or weighted code. That is all for this video. Thank you for watching.